well, even before I got out of the Air Force, uh, John Lilly's book, Man and Dolphin, had come out. And uh, he was talking about communicating with a so-called alien species. Uh, he, he talked a lot about their large brain size. And of course, I'd read other papers about that. And uh, of course, that fascinated me. Also, there, uh, the commanding officer at Point Magoo uh, recognized the need for an animal health officer, but uh, he, he said, well, let's try to get one that's got a lot of experience. But of course, they looked around, there wasn't anybody that had any experience. So just my uh, uh, few efforts uh, with uh, Dr. Miller at POP, and I also went uh, down and visited with uh, David Brown and some others at Marineland, the Pacific. I went over to UCLA and visited with uh, Professor Ken Norris, who was formerly curator at Marineland and uh, who was then teaching a course at UCLA, and we and I audited that course. And uh, so uh, at, by the time I was ready to get out of the Air Force, uh, when they looked around, I was the most experienced <laughs> veterinarian available. <laughs> so, uh, so they hired me immediately when I went out of the Air Force uh, as a Navy civilian.